another month has passed and today I'm going to be showing you five dope Android apps you can get for the month of August 2016. Everything will be listed in the description below and while you're at it make sure to go ahead and add me on Snapchat right here or in the description below because then you won't miss out on any future updates. Anyway guys, let's get started. To kick things off, we have an app from Philips, which is a dictation app and software that can be downloaded from pretty much anywhere. So whatever device you have, whatever platform you're on, you can pretty much download it. This app is pretty much for anyone and isn't actually just for businesses. Simply all you need to do is head over to their website and sign up for a 30 day free trial, which gives you access to the SpeechLive cloud. Then go into the app and record whatever you want. It could be some important paperwork or actually just something as simple as a shopping list. Once you have finished recording the content, it will automatically save the whole memo and then you'll be able to access it within a few seconds. This app is actually really useful for content creators because all you need to do is record your script or video um, in the application and then send it over to the transcription service and they will type it up for you and then you can add subtitles on your videos which is really awesome. It's very similar to Siri, just that the speech recognition doesn't work in real time. You first finish your recording, choose the option, speech recognition, and then you get the written document. I was really impressed with what this app actually offers and it did save me a lot of time and I didn't have to type up as many things as I needed to. Also, I will leave it linked in the description below and you'll get 10 minutes free transcription service, which is a great deal. Every single month, Ketchup seems to be killing it with some more dope games, and I have found another one called Zigzag, which is super addictive. All you need to do is tap the screen to change direction and try to get as far as you can in the game. As you get a higher score, the pace of the game increases, which makes it harder. But what I like about this game is that it's like not too hard, but it's not too easy and Ketchup just got it spot on. So if you definitely want an app to kill some time, then this is the app for you. The next app is called XN Spy and what it really is, is an app dashboard. You can try out the demo for yourself in the description below. Now this is a monitoring and tracking app, which is compatible with both iOS and Android. Let's start off with what you can do. You are able to track phone logs and it will tell you detailed information about each call. You can also keep an eye on messages, emails and internet history. My favorite feature about this has to be the GPS tracking system because it will tell you where that device was at certain times which is really convenient. Now you may be wondering who would actually want something like this. Well it's actually great for businesses to keep an eye on their employees and maybe a curious parent. I will leave it linked in the description below and it's definitely a great service to invest in. So go Going back to Android games, I found an app which is really fun to play. It's called Just Rolling and it's self-explanatory, however all you need to do is tap the screen which changes the way the ball goes. The aim of the game is to get as far as you can and also avoid the little obstacles that get in your way. The further you get in the game, the harder it actually becomes, however it's actually a simple concept but it really works and it is definitely an addicting game so I will leave it linked in the description below. Lastly is Wally or Wally, I'm not quite sure how to pronounce it but pretty much the way it works is artists or creators can upload their pictures of work on the app and then users can download it and set their work as their backgrounds on their phones. There are hundreds of designs to choose from and each one is unique and trust me, there is bound to be at least one design in there that you will like. There's so many to choose from and they're all really good. Well, most of them anyway. The wallpaper I chose is really dope and it works really well with my Zupa widget clock and it just fits in with everything on my home screen. But overall, it's a nice app and it has a clean UI. And there we go. That's going to wrap it up for this month's five apps. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. If you did enjoy it, make sure to leave a massive thumbs up. Also, I'm going to be following back the first 10 people which go onto my Instagram page, comment and follow me um, on any one of my pictures, letting me know you came from this video and I'll follow you. So basically, first come, first serve. Lastly, um, add me on Snapchat right here as then you won't miss out on any more updates. Comment down below, hashtag, I need to think on the spot, hashtag, Okay, hashtag tree, and yeah, that's about it. Anyway, guys, I'm Hamza from Super Extreme Video, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Ladies, lads, bye.